Now, quick warning. Now, for me personally, I've been using Blender Octane, the free version, for the last five years. This is the year I'm committing. I should have did it last year. I was on the fence and I should have pulled the trigger and I didn't. But this year I'm going to do it, especially just because of the, the, the Grayscale Gorilla assets. And I want to have access to that 2026 render engine. Once it comes out, I want to get immediate access instead of having to wait till it waters down to the free tier. And again, I want to have access to the full version of the Octane standalone so I can really broaden my, my knowledge of the Octane render system. Oh, and you can't forget, that render network access. Now, quick warning, who is this not for? If you are hardcore about cycles and you do not plan to switch, this is not for you. Or if you're still on the fence, and you're just playing with it, I wouldn't recommend you purchasing this. Just stick with the free one until you get comfortable like I did and then switch when you're ready to switch. But this year I am because I'm, I'm really excited about what they've got set up for this year's uh, assets. And it's just something I wanted to share some info out there. So if anybody's interested, hopefully this might help you take your step or what, decide what you want to do. If you're thinking about getting into Octane seriously, this might be the cheapest moment of the whole year to jump in. If you want to get help getting started or you just want to be surrounded by artists who are learning just like you, join my free Blender Octane community. Links down below.